Um, our next performer, uh, Storm and I first saw them at um, PAX East two or three years ago, I think. And we both looked at each other and we said, we got to get them on the cruise. And then Jonathan uh, did a show. We did a show that uh, Travis McElroy hosted at New York Comic Con that she came and performed on. Uh, and he looked over at us and said, we got to get them on the cruise. So we got them on the cruise. Uh, we were asking beforehand what uh, what she wanted us to say about her, uh, you know, how she'd like to be introduced. She said, no, just say this is fine. And we said, well, I don't know, like, is there anything else, you know, about you we should let them know? And she said, well, I guess I'm having a really good time here this week, so. She's having a really good time here this week. Please welcome to the stage, Samus. Uh, and here's verse two. 
Uh, I knew I shouldn't say that I have a chronic illness, because now you're telling me about the tonics for your illness. I was simply sharing, didn't ask for your advice. I sure wasn't aware that you're an expert. Oh, how nice. Wait, you're not an MD, and you're not an RN, so what you're telling me is that you're more like Dr. Quinn. You're a fictional account of a role that don't exist. Just keep what you're handing out. I am not Oliver Twix. I told you do not enter, find a different block to pick. You think you're Dr. Hibbert when you're built like Dr. Nick. You should guzzle down a dozen dicks. You're a fraud. I'm tired of you. Now you got me puzzled, bitch. You pit like Dr. Mario. I'm throwing up the peace sign. Call me Peter Seeger. Cause you're giving me the blues, man. I feel like freaking Skeeter. But you'd rather met to poke around, so check me for a fever. They grab your stethoscope and down it right up on my speaker. And then, thank you very much. Don't give any fucks. I should break your face. You are taking up my space. Thank you.